I'm Carrie with White Magic Sammy Ed, and this is Alabama and we're gonna do a little piece today on oral health and of course our beautiful babies their teeth and their molars and their canines and chewing and what is the best what I feel is the most amazing thing you can give your dogs they love it he is trying desperately to get to these wonderful bones if this is a basically a cow knuckle bone and you can get them from your butcher you can get them where I get them from is from uh, White Dog Bone Company, which I give everyone a little uh, sheet in their binder regarding where you can get it, and they give you like 10% off your first order. These are fabulous for their teeth. They get down, see how he's gnawing? See how he's gnawing on the back of his canine, his molars? This is the best way to floss and for your baby's teeth to have the most beautiful teeth possible. My guys never need a dental, ever, till 13, 14 years of age if they have these. Now, a lot of people are afraid. What if my dog chips off a piece? Could they? Absolutely. Would it hurt him? Absolutely not. So this is what they do in the wild. If a Sammy Ed was to take down a, for example, a deer, or it'd be the closest thing to a cow, they would be, first they would eat the intestines, which is where all the grains and natural vitamins and minerals are. Then, after they've enjoyed all of that and the meat, they would then chew and gnaw on the bone. You get calcium and nutrition from this. So this is great for your puppy's bone, for their ears, for calcium. So this is like a multi, I'd say a multi-nutritional thing that's so important. So bones are hard to get right now. You, with thanks to COVID, you can't get marrow bones anywhere from any grocery store unless you get those little sliver ones. The sliver ones are great, but they can get wrapped around their muzzle and locked on their teeth. So that's okay, but you gotta be confident you can pop it off. So these are great. Once they get down to about that big, you know, so big, then I take them out. But how do you brush your dog's teeth? Here's the answer. So here's a new one. And of course, Alabama is super excited. Alabama will be five months old on the 18th of April here. And it's they're made by the Red Barn Company. And again, White Dog Bone Company carries these. You might be able to find them elsewhere online, but make sure you get this quality. This is no insecticides, no pesticides, no no preservatives. This is a real sterilized, as you can see, he loves this, white dog bone cup, white and sterile bone. So this is how everyone is gonna take care of their dog's teeth, for beautiful white teeth for their entire life. And it's easy, it's not gonna stain their legs, it's not gonna stain your furniture. They're just great. So do your dogs get possessive over them? Mine don't but I'm the boss, so we're not gonna have any problems with that. <laughs> and, and, and they're fine. Just if you have multiple dogs, then you have to watch out for dog aggression, dog to dog, because they want everybody's bones. So in that case, you may wanna put, give them their bones in their crates where they're safe and they're not gonna fight over them. But if you just have one or two dogs, you know, a little bit of, uh, you know, watching, overseeing, like us parents have to do, is fine. But anyway, this is how, White Magic some ways take care of oral health and again, beautiful pearly teeth. And it's great when babies are teething and going from puppy to adult. Whoops, there goes the phone. But anyway, you guys have a great week. We'll see you guys soon with a new update on care and great tips on raising your salmon.